Hi, it's Peter Carney. I'm in my urban farm in Draper and I wanted to talk to you about intercropping in vegetable gardens. These are four beds in, in our patch and starting on the left hand side we have corn there which is very big up to two and a half meters high with lots of cobs and down below in the corn we have bush beans which are very productive so maximizing the ground space while the corn grows upwards <clears throat> and then this bed here is all garlic there's 120 garlics here and so what we've done is planted beetroot in between the garlic so in the rows of the garlic uh, there's four garlics across on this 80 centimeter bed and then between those rows there's three beetroots it's a lot of production out of the space and the thing with the the beetroots take only about three months to finish whereas the garlic takes um, six to seven months in this bed here we have a mixture of leafy greens and herbs and greens of all different uh, varieties um, lots of brassicas in here and so we always mix uh, coriander with the brassicas uh, to help with uh, insect management and on the bed here on the left there are tomatoes on the climber with basil at the front and then uh, lettuces down below so the the space is totally maximized you see this beautiful color of flowers and leafy greens in the bed here in the morning sunlight fantastic and over here there is a uh, potato bed and that potato bed has uh, two rows of potatoes and we have some climbing beans purple king climbing beans that grow in our cool season up the middle so using the air space above the uh, the middle of the bed see I'm just putting mulch around the base and then down here in this root bed we've mixed carrots and turmeric so turmeric takes eight to ten months and so we planted these carrots about two and a half months ago and we'll be, we're starting to harvest them now because the turmeric won't be ready to pull out until July or August which is another two to three months so see that beautiful combination of greens in there okay so that's uh, that's it for me with the intercropping it's really fantastic at increasing diversity and uh, production out of the space and keeping it healthy and we always manage our spaces with biodynamic preparations and uh, that potentize all organic practices thanks Peter Carney